Hello friends, God bless you. Um, and I wanted to uh, share something that I found in uh, Deuteronomy 27, 5 and 6 verse and that you read again um, uh, in Joshua chapter 8. Moses instruct very specifically to Joshua that when you enter into Israelites, when you enter into promised land, this is you should do. You build altar using uncut stone. And then you offer burnt offering and peace offering and then you rejoice. And that exactly Joshua did. Joshua built altar of uncut stones and he offered burnt offering and, and peace offering and people rejoiced. Why? Why uncut stones? What was so reason that at, at exactly when they enter in a promised land, they have to use the altar of uncut stone. And, and if you read scriptures, and if this is what I think is fascinating, you will find. Number one, when people can cut the stone and build something, there is a tendency or there is a there is a fear that people can boast that how beautiful construction I have made. God didn't want us to do that because he wants us to realize that whatever happened in our life or whatever we are receiving as a blessing from God, it is his doing. He was the one who drowned the Pharaoh's army and delivered people. God was the one who gave Israelite when they were uh, the victory over Amalekite, when they didn't even know how to fight. They were slaves. They just came out from slavery. And he is the one who brought, he, he, who brought down the walls of Jericho and gave Israelites victory. God wanted them to see that it is his goodness and his provision and his protection that made them to make all the way to the promised land. It was he, though, uh, he who brought him to the promised land. So God says that just build the altar with the uncut stone so you will never brag of uh, about your ability or your skills or your strength or anything. And the second thing, God says that when you cut the stone, it is a laborious work. And God says that I am your provider. I am doing everything for you. I want you to just rest. And then he says that enjoy, rejoice. That's why he said that use the uncut stone, offer your burnt offering, offer your peace offering and rejoice in my rest. And that's why somebody said that when we work, God rests. But when we rest in his rest, God works. So God is leading us into promised land. And he wants us to remember that whatever blessings we have is his doing. Let us use just the uncut stones to build the altar, to offer our burnt offering or peace offering and rejoice in his rest because that God wants us to have it. I think God has blessed you today. Thank you.